for having us in your manufacturing facility today. Now, today we're going to investigate and find out about Microlock making Microlock. Now, what's happening on this machine, Matt? Right, well, this is our, our large horizontal uh, machining centre. And what we're doing is actually manufacturing the, the grid plate that the vices sit on. It's quite a large one, this one. It's, uh, I believe it's 750 by 700 and it uh, weighs about 200 kilos. And um, we're holding it in the Microlock vices. So basically, you're using Microlock to manufacture Microlock. Now, right. when you're holding that kind of weight in a vertical position, there's a lot of forces that want to pull it down. So is this really illustrating the clamping force of the Microlock? And can you describe the way in which you've uh, situated the clamps and, and the stops? Well, what we've got here is you, you've got the fixtures on the bottom. We've got about three fixtures on the bottom and that's locating the workpiece. And then you've got vice jaws, three on the top and one on the side, and that's holding it and pulling it down onto the face and keeping it accurate. So that is holding all of that weight. Now, the actual grid plate that's actually on the, on, on the tombstone, if you like, of the machine is actually a microlock grid plate, that's the same right. as what you're actually manufacturing. That's right, that's a 1500 by 750 microlock plate holding a microlock plate, yeah. Now, when you selling these microlock plates to cover the full envelope of a machine bed what advantages does the customer get from that well it, it's i mean microlock's not just a holding system it's a, a referencing system as well so the advantages are that you know exactly where your date and points are relative to the base and the machine at all times so by filling your table that enables you to clamp very small and very large parts all in known date and positions because I think that sometimes, you know, when you look at Microlock, you're not always aware of the grid plates that are also available and you're fully utilising that envelope then with that rather than just having the standalone systems that you also do. Yeah, I mean, it's always best um, really to, to fill the machine table because that gives, that future proofs what you're going to do. Don't get me wrong, I sell a lot of systems, small systems that go on half a machine and stuff like that. But the best solution really is to fill the table. Now I look at Microlock and I think to myself, it's perfect for prismatic parts, but what happens when you get irregular shaped parts, Matt? Well, for irregular shapes, we do uh, soft jaws and we make them in aluminium or in steel. Uh, you can profile your job. Um, you can hold very large round parts because you can clamp in at either direction. Uh, so really, you, you adapt Microlock to suit your own needs. I think this is a real testament to Microlock when you actually see the manufacturer using Microlock to make Microlock and I really appreciate the insight into this manufacturing process, Matt. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks. Yeah.